What is going on, mortals? Mortal T here. And today we are on a new game for us. Uh, this game has been out for, oh, I don't know, about a week, I'm thinking. Um, so this isn't a full game. This is a preview game. So it's still uh, in building progress. So there is going to be glitches and bugs and everything that we probably will get frustrated to uh, with. Um, but a lot of people have started playing this game. I downloaded it before the game actually came out, but I didn't play it because I was playing another game. Um, but yeah, this is grounded, and it's basically like Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. Now, if you don't know that film reference, just go and type it in on Google. It's basically a scientist creates a shrinking ray and shrinks his own kids down to about the size we are now. Um, so yeah, Mortal T got shrunk and put into a garden with ants, spiders... I don't know, just a bunch of bugs that are either the same size or really big. And it can get pretty, like, scary, but fun. Um, so, yeah, this is starting out. I haven't done nothing. I haven't done anything. Yeah, that's a baseball compared to our size. I wish you could, wish you could go into another, uh, like, camera angle. Yeah, I know you can go into third person, but I really wish that, really wish you could, could see yourself compared to this thing, but you can't look at yourself. Nah, that's unfortunate. What's that? So yeah, we're basically just gonna play through. There is some kind of story mode to this, uh, but it's very small and short at this present moment in time. They are expanding it with updates. Um, but yeah, this is good. This is a survival game. That's what it is. It's a survival game. A bit like Ark Survival Evolved. You have your food, water, stamina, health. All that good stuff. There's armor upgrades. There's builder boards. You can actually build a base. Uh, different weapons. Utility items. And just a bunch of really cool ideas that they brought to this game. Now, I'm just going around just... Picking everything up that I can at the moment. Because this game can be like pretty resource intensive. So the more you pick up, the better you're going to be. We just need to be super careful. There is a research station over here. Uh, we just need to be on the lookout for anything that's like really bad for us. So here's the research station. We can actually analyze a bunch of stuff. So we only get like three, uh, three of these at a time, which is a charge selector valid resource. Blah, 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 blah. So we now get woven fibers. Let's analyze the stone or pebble or whatever you want to call it. We can make an axe now. Uh, and let's analyze this. So there are multiple research stations uh, around, like, ev everywhere. Oh, ants. Okay. Now, ants can be friendly. The normal ants are friendly like this. Just the worker ants are really friendly. Look, they won't attack you. But other ants, like soldier ants, they will attack you on sight. So, yeah. So at the moment, I'm thinking about getting set up, caught up, get some maybe some armor and stuff going. Yeah. Kill you. Ah, ah. Gotcha. What were you eating? Okay. So yeah, the main storyline is to do with obviously getting big again. It's probably the size of a, a some nap. Eh? Oh, hello. It's <laughs> me up. Uh, I might do a series where I just go in creative mode as well, because there is a creative mode to this where we can just build and free roam, and it would be absolutely amazing. I'm just hoping I don't run into anything like bad straight away. So we have got a crafting. We can actually craft phobin, uh, woven fibers. How many can we craft? And what's woven fiber good for? So if you've got any hints or tips, let me know down in the comments below. Oh, we can actually... 
We can actually make one of them. Can we craft a hammer? No, I need two more sprigs. Uh, is there a quick way to get to your next hall, or do you have to do it like that? Ants. They're attacking something. As long as they're not attacking me, I am fine. So yeah, we need more of these guys, I think. So let's gather them up. Gather everything. Make a, a hammer. Anything cool. Clovers. Oh, wow. Is that like a charge attack? Oh, no. Okay. I thought it was like a charge attack. <laughs> charge hit like. But no. Uh, I'm just making sure there's nothing around. Because spiders and stuff can creep up on you. So there we may. We can make a spear with a pebble. So, oh, there's a pebble. More pebbles. Ooh, one of these. Where are you? Haha. Uh. -ha. Gotcha. So yeah, bugs are harvestable. When you kill them, you can pick up parts. And it gives you ability to craft different types of armors. I know there's like ant armor, ladybug armor, uh, acorn armor, clover armor. There's, there's a bunch of different armors. So let's make a spear. What do we need for a torch? Two sprigs. And dried grass chunks. So the sprigs are pretty much easy. So a bunch of them over here. There's one. There's two. So what um, are these? I'm guessing this is like a dried grass chunk. Oh, that. See, that got rid of it all at once. Are these what I need to craft what I wanted. Uh, no. Tools. Torch. Okay, now we got a torch. I'm getting everything... Well, I'm trying to get everything done as soon as I possibly can. So now, just investigate the mysterious machine. Which is this machine right here. Like I said, this is part of the... Uh, story mode. And we can activate it if we want. As you can see, they're now letting out beams of light. There's an obstruction, obviously, in the line because it's not connecting right. Find out where the weak point of the laser is. Let's do the storyline right now. I might just do it. Might as well. So I'm guessing we got to go over to this massive one here. Ah, oh, here we go. These guys are eating the wire. Get off the wire, you. Any more? Why am I in a, like a big battle? Oh, good. I'm in a battle with them. There's quite a few of them. Lava. Lawn mite. Come here, you. Okay, I'm guessing I've got to go and kill these. That's a nap. Get off me. Ow. Turn up a gun. I'm picking all these up because I don't actually know what they do. Any more? I can hear something scuttling around. Oh, there's one there. I think it's stuck, is he? Yeah, I think he was stuck. Pick up that one then. Right then. What else we gotta do? Oh, there's another one. Die. Got you. Oh, there's a few more down here. Oh, wow. Okay, we're in a cave and I cannot see. Can we... Oh, yes, we can actually hold a torch and do this. That's awesome. Ah, oh, more of them. <laughs> oh, yeah. Can't get past me. Ah, oh, more of them. Now, get off. Stop eating electric wires. What's this? Ooh. I can actually get these. That's cool. Okay, there's a bunch of these we can grab. I think these can make torches. Need a hammer for that. Uh, I have got a hammer. Ah, 
This is. Oh wow. Okay. <clears throat> and we can pick up all this stuff. I don't know if we've done it. There's still an obstruction that I haven't done. Kind of worrying. Uh, no, let's. I want that one out. My mom always says I light up a room. More sprigs. Oh, what's that? What are you in the ground? What's that? Ooh. I think that's it then. I think that's pretty much done. Oh, that's the obstruction. <laughs> uh, let get my axe out. Which one is it? Is it this one? Yeah. There we go. Boom. Done. Easy peasy. Shall we just activate it and get the small cutscene? Activate that stuff. We get a small cutscene now. So basically, this is like the introduction to the game. It's actually pretty cool. I like how it's designed and everything. But oh no, something went wrong. We're not going to get back to our normal size as quick as we thought. So now we need to go to the tree, which is over in this direction. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> sort of fell through there. Uh, we can put our torch away because it is daylight. Oh, we could actually create a save point just in case we do die. Oh, what? No, I didn't mean to throw my axe. I didn't even know you could do that. That's madness. Um, So, craft. Crafting menu. Where would it be? Material. I can get a hat. <laughs> uh... Or do we have to make... No, lean to. Ah, I've actually got enough to build this. So just for now, I'm just going to build it near this mysterious thing. Uh, and then we just build. Awesome. Yo, 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 yo! Yo, yo! Ah! Gimme. Yeah? Trying to... Trying to come up and kiss me? So yeah, now we just use... We set spawn point. So now we can sleep and everything as well. And if we die, we basically just spawn back here. But let's go over to the ochre tree. Ah, ah gotcha, aphid. That's that's a spider. Oh, he can't zoom in, but I can block. I'm pretty sure that's a spider. I don't know if it's sleeping or not, though. Need to be very careful of that on the way back. Pretty sure this is where we meant to go. Yeah, in here. Right, it, right, it, let's go. Those look Ooh, like cool. idealized geometric shapes in that paint thing. They can't be real. Locked. Okay, how do we get through here then? Locked. Okay, what do we do? Oh, what's that? Transcription unit 87.9.5. Order number one. How am I supposed to get across there? This is locked. Have to press a button. Ooh, press a button. Does this work? Locked. Oh, will you now? Good grilling. A feature useful only to your obsolete burger flipping brethren now consigned to the scrappy. Locked again. What? I need you to monitor these readings. Am I supposed to turn like turn all these green or something? I thought this was just open. Oh. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we had to get more green to turn open the door. Okay, that's fine. Oh. More buttons. Oh, I can't press them. Big shiny buttons. Oh, who are you? Get away from me! Get away from me! Ow! Ow! You shocked me! Die. Dude! That dude shocked me! I'm exploring. This is the robot, though. This is supposed to be our robot friend. Where are you hurt? How are we fixing a robot with twigs and leaves and stuff? 
This I is... am Burgle. I'm Burgle. 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 I am also a robot. Are you sure, now? This all must be very disorienting for you, but hopefully I can explain. I suspect you were miniaturized and brought here by the ominous researchers. Well, no. No. <laughs> that didn't happen. Because a power surge has knocked down all the systems. What's that? Is this? I don't suppose you would know Ooh. anything about that. No. no. Why would you? Okay, moving on. The batteries here are completely drained, so we'll need to charge them up. Okay, how do we do that? Ooh, analyzer. I'm also happy to answer whatever questions you might have. What's that? I'm picking up a bunch of stuff. You have found Burgle. Okay. And the story is just getting started. There is so much more to do, more to uh, more mysteries to uncover. Continue to explore, build bases, take on Burgle's quests, and provide feedback. We are making new content creatures and stories. Stay tuned for new updates soon. Thank you again for your support and being part of the community. So that is it. That's end of the storyline right there. Done, dusted, and everything. Um, so, Burger, we can actually give stuff to. I, can, I, I found a couple of these chips. Oh, give him the chip. Put it into his head. Boom. I thought I got two of them. Do you have work for me? What's the work? You get, like, daily quests, and it gives you, like, science points. This is what you need. So I need to kill a weevil... Uh, kill free gnats. Explore marker at Oak Beacon. I'm hearing some weird sound. But is that it? That, th that is the end of the storyline. What is that sound though? I hear this weird, really weird sound. What the hell? Anyone else hear this sound? It's really weird. That's some creepy ass sound. Right, can I analyze stuff here? Yes, I can. Hmm, what do I want to analyze? Don't even know. Can I analyze this? That gives me a do collector. Analyze the acorn, because I'm pretty sure this can give us, like, acorn armor and stuff. And... This as well. So it charges a roughly in 18 minutes, is that? So yeah, that gave us a bunch of clover stuff as well. We can actually get out here. What's that? I actually don't have a clue what that noise is, but it's really annoying. Ooh. Something over there, though. That's a look like a big drop. I'm not very good at parkour, so I need to be extremely careful. Uh, torch. Fiat loops. Science points. Awesome. How many science points we got? We got 820 science points. Okay, we got back up. So yeah, we progress through the game, we base build, we unlock some more stuff, and yeah, we just have a lot of fun. Can we get out this way? Yeah, okay. We can't go in here though, can we? No. So yeah, welcome to Grounded. As more updates come out for this, it should get pretty darn cool. That's a spider! No 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 That's a spider and it's coming towards me That's just a no brainer as soon as I come out there's a giant spider there Are you just kidding me game? It's right there It's literally right there Ah what? It got in and I'm dead How did it get into the base? No way, it got into a base. That was a wolf spider. How? That's madness. 
So Moles, yeah, I'm going to end it on that point. I can't believe it jumped into this small space. I didn't think that was possible. But Moles, I will be making more videos in this, so I hope you enjoy it. And I hope you all liked my little scream there, because that was really <laughs> unexpected. And I'll hopefully see you in the next video.